name is Xamarin. Today we're gonna be watching the miraculous Ladybug Paris special, Shadybug and Clown Noir, which I am so excited to watch. I've been like seeing every trailer, every little image we get, because I am so excited to watch this with you all. Please keep in mind, guys, if you want to see my full uncut reaction to this and everything miraculous, you can do that by supporting me over on my Patreon page. Link down in the description below. But without further ado, let's get started. In the daytime, I'm Gabriel. Ah! Just a normal man with a normal life. A normal man! But I have a secret. I must keep at any cost or all hope will be lost. <laughs> Miraculous. Oh my god! The power of love will free us all. <laughs> oh my god! That was amazing! I'm in love. Luckily, Ladybug and Cat Noir have saved Paris yet again. Oh, wait. Clara, you're lying. Is it ready? Can we make the jump? There's a 92.7% statistical chance of landing in a world where these source images originate. <gasps> oh. Okay, I see what's happening now. We don't have a Ladybug and Cat Noir. Fly, my Kamiko, and magnify the glimmer Kimiko. of hope that shines in Alia Sasea's heart. Ubiquity, I am better fly. Ubiquity. I give you the oh! power to connect to the parallel world we have located so we can find help. With this gift, I am exposing you to many perils and placing a great burden on your shoulders. Do you accept it for the greater good? Hasperia's looking mighty fine, I'm just gonna say. But it is weird that he's partnering up with, like, children. Uh oh! 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 Oh, shit, here they are! This special is already hype. That opening was amazing. Like 10 out of 10. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Focus in, focus in. I am strong. I will not just like fangirl the entire time. Aww. I like that it's on mute. The drama. Yeah, get away. He don't need you and we proved that already. This power is so heavy, Plaque. Not for real, Plaque. What if I ended up destroying everything around me without even meaning to? Wouldn't that be crazy? Yeah, so this is very, very early in season five. Glad to like have that just like here. We know where we're at. Monarch's got all the miraculous and Cat Noir and I. It's just the two of us again. I feel like I've tried everything. I just don't know what to do anymore. Marinette, it's normal for you to have your doubts, but you can't give up hope. Alia? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> oh, whoa! Oh! <laughs> oh, it like changed Alia. That's crazy. My name is Betterfly. I need someone to lead Better me to fly. the quarters of the miraculous of the ladybug and the black cat in your world. Ladybug and cat noir, but I don't know how to find them. I I don't know them. I'm just Marinette. Oh, whoa. Marinette? What just happened? You transformed into... Ubiquity. In the universe where I come from, Alia says there's my ally. She connected her power to you in order to open a gateway between our two worlds. Oh, whoa. I'm sorry. They made me open again. I can't hold them back for uh -oh. long. You can't stay here. They are merciless. Hey, me. I'm not meaning it. I'm just saying if he picked me up, just saying. But I am a grown adult woman and he is a grown adult man. It's different. Don't look now. Here comes trouble. Trouble. There. You can have your boyfriend what? back. Oh, no. Hey, don't eat the tail. At least now it's being put to good use. <laughs> Even in this world, we find pictures of that self-centered Adrian Agrest. Well, obviously, he can only be perfect here, too. A perfect oh. stuck-up brat. Oh, no. Awkward. What are they doing? I guess they're just being bad or trying to get the miraculous. You carried out your mission perfectly. Thank you for everything. I release you from the power I gave you. Oh. Marinette? Okay. Oh, we're fine. Everything's fine, Mr. Pink Chang. We just, uh, we started, 
playing a video game and the sound was too loud. That's all. So he uses it to express people's hearts in a positive way so he can make allies for himself. That's so cool. I love that. Oh my God, I love Shady Bug. I'm obsessed <laughs> with her. Oh, where did he go? Lucky charm! Oh my God, please. Oh. There it is. Really clever to make a butterfly tracker. We've never done that before. That's cool. Whatever happens, stay here where it's safe. No one should suffer because of a battle that isn't theirs. Aww. Thank you for your help, little Kamiko. That's not an Akuma? An Akuma? Oh. Huh. Yeah, so they're a positive thing. A Kamiko. I love that. Uh... Oh, what are you what okay? a cad. I love the fact that this is the special we get. That's the last thing we're going to get to hear of Keith being Gabriel or better fly. I adore it. Oh my God. He looks so good. Like what a man. He is just like, I love the purple. Y'all know me. I love my purple. So he is just killing it. He's so sweet. I'm very interested in like just his like world and his story, like his son turning away from him. It's so sad, but I love him. Like, oh, he's so dashing and so charming and so calming. Like, it's going to be okay. Like, it's like, okay, sure, daddy, it's okay. <laughs> I believe you. Boogerfly, we know you're hiding here. <laughs> Boogerfly, we'll turn this lousy world to ash. Oh, no. I'm sorry that you got involved in this fight. Please take care of yourself. Stop! Aww. The people of this world haven't harmed you! You know what to do then! Hand over the miraculous you stole! Yes, girl! Yes! This is my girl! That's my girl! I love her! I knew Shady Bug was my girl! I fuck with her so hard! They're the holders of the miraculous of the ladybug and the black cat from one of the billions of parallel universes in existence. Billions? And those two are not very nice versions. Excuse you? Parallel universes? Why didn't you tell me about this? Please, will you lay off? Excuse me, why? It's your fault! You shouldn't have stolen the miraculous from him! The Supreme abuses his powers! What? Power must be shared! How can they use their powers repeatedly without transforming back? They use their miraculous for evil purposes. It overrides the security system. No more automatic detransformation. But the price to pay for that is terrible. Oh no! But my girl, she's endangering herself. No, I love her too much. Meredith, you have to save Shady Bug, please. Join the resistance! Everything can change! This world is the proof of it! It's not too late for you! Uh, the resistance ends here! With you! Oh, oh, no. Whoa! Whoa! That's intimidating! someone that is queen bee behavior think you're the cool cat oh, oh is the itty bitty kitty scared he might hurt me with his cute little claws oh no <gasps> no black cat is as cool as this black cat oh no oh he just cataclysm him Ooh, okay. What's hers? Not a gun or a sword. It's a traffic cone. Traffic cone? Oh no, I'm so scared. <laughs> and it's gone. This is lame. <laughs> Our ladybug's lame in comparison. And who the cat are you? Betterfly, it's an honor. Uh, I know, I'll explain everything <laughs> to you later. <laughs> Right, it's actually kind of a rocket launcher, but even cooler! <laughs> oh my god, look at it! Oh, 
she could just she could just wipe it away. Oh my god, she's so cool. Oh, being evil is ten times cooler than being good. Uh, oh. Do you accept this gift I am offering you for the greater good? I do. Oh, whoa! Break her tank off! Oh, that's so cool. You can't wait! From you, maybe kitty catty. Oh. Later, loser! <laughs> <laughs> I should just stop me with. Okay. Oh my god, I love Celeste Cat. This is so fun seeing all these different transformations. For his neutral special, he wields a gun. Oh, the goddamn gun is back. Dear passengers, you may now unbuckle your seatbelts. Well, Captain and his crew have got a pleasant flight. I'll save you. Don't worry, cockroach. I'll catch you. Uh, oh, no. too bad. I was this close. Oh, these two. Oh, try that again. <sighs> bag. Oh, okay. So they are not allies. So cool. Look at him. He looks amazing. Can he only do one at a time or can he do multiple? Cats. Uh oh. Why are you always trying to steal my miraculous? Like you never try to steal mine. I'm just trying to get rid of you, fully bag. I'd be better on my own. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. <sighs> I feel a dual source of anger and despair. Uh -oh. Oh, I like that we're partnering up with Butterfly, Betterfly, and then they're partnering up with Monarch. That's so fun. I'll be the one to seize the miraculous of the butterfly in the end, and I'll be the one the Supreme spares. In your dreams! Yeah, who is the Supreme? Go. I'm still very curious about that. You didn't make me so angry. Butterfly wouldn't have detected our emotions, Kitty Catty. Uh, don't get angry! Uh, <sighs> <laughs> Fine, fine. Let's calm down. So then, what do we do now? It's a good thing I still have a brain. And a lead. Just saying, if you two felt the need to make out, that'd be kind of cool. You got the enemies to lover Trump going on? <laughs> Just saying, if you feel curious about exploring feelings, it'd be a good time. She's freed herself. She can't be far. Oh, Alia! Alia! Stop lying to me. She is right there. <sighs> What's is wrong? Crying? Your world is so different, so beautiful. You uh, help each other. Your partners. Oh. In mine, any form of mutual aid is a crime. Wow. In my universe, ordinary people don't even know about the miraculous. It's oh. a secret. They all belong to the Supreme, who uses them only to perpetuate his own power. I too was a part of this corrupt system, in order to get something I wanted more than anything. I stole two, but I misused them. Oh. To redeem myself, I became Betterfly, because, like a moth, I have no choice but to fly in the shadows in order to give people hope. Wow. Someone has to show them that we must revolt, that a better world is possible, provided that power is shared between all. Incredible. Ugh, Cat Noir, we haven't known each other for very long, but it feels like we've been together forever. Ugh, Ladybug. Of course. I should have known. Mm. Oh. Does that give you any feelings, Carly? Like, maybe you want to go kiss your little enemy over there? Maybe? Possibly not forcing you to do anything, or, <laughs> you know. In my world, I'm hunted relentlessly. No one believes in heroes. Everyone is afraid of the Supreme. Who is the Supreme? The girls are here for me, as always. They really are the best. They inspire me every day. It's so amazing to have a best friend like her. We're super close, you know. She's always there for me. I love that Marinette writes everything down in a diary that could absolutely incriminate her. Always my favorite plot point we have. I finally know why Hawk Moth wants our magic jewels so badly. By combining my miraculous of the ladybug with the one of the black cat, you get to make a wish. But for that wish to come true, there would be a price to pay. Oh, I don't like that she's learning this. Do they not know this? Lucky charm. Uh -oh. That's not good. 
Oh my god, the drama! Okay, so Shadybug now knows the identity of Claude Noir. Blocks off. Oh no. He used too much of his power. <gasps> Are they in love? Does he love her? <gasps> of course, because it's the reverse. Ah! Oh my god. Oh! You know me? Tiki, ah! Plague, reveal yourselves! Oh, no. Why fight to get a better life when I could just switch with someone else's in another world? Uh oh. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh no? Oh, it doesn't work. Oh. 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 oh gosh. I'm trying to think about who the Supreme would be. My best guess is it's not just like one person. It's just that the whole guardians of the miraculous are just like the Supreme. Because it seems like they're using kind of that same like a uh, magic seal sort of look like the one that's on the actual miracle box. It looks like the order is just like bad. So because of that, they just prevent people from being able to make the wish, which is nice and useful. I kind of wish we had something like that to like prevent people from making it and rewriting the entire universe. But at the same time, not the cost of the Kwamis not being able to like talk and express themselves. Like that was really sad to see. Like I felt so bad for like Tiki and Plague. Broke my heart. Marinette, wow. is everything all right? Yeah, whatever, just get my back. Uh-oh, her face. Are you sure you're okay, sweetheart? Yes, I'm okay, I... Sorry. Mommy, dear, I, I just oh, got my sewing machine, but it's fine. It's just slightly damaged. Uh -oh. Don't worry, sweetie. We'll take care of it. Broken things can always be fixed. Oh. Good night, sweetie. I love you. I love you, too. That's so sad. Gosh, you can just see how much on her face that she's been overusing her miraculous powers. I like the fact that they address the the whole like you could infinitely use the power over and over and over again but it does take a toll on your body i'm really glad that we talked about that but oh my gosh getting to learn that that like since they're just evil they can do it over and over again but look at ma alternate marinette's just like neck and her face like that's so sad to see like i'm curious if it's like they're just kind of like, you know, stuck, affected forever. Or like, will things be okay? Because technically she's had this. So even if we do like Miraculous Ladybug, isn't this still going to be affected? Like, isn't she still going to have like a, you know, messed up body? Essentially, it sounds really bad to phrase it that way. But she's still going to be affected by this magic overuse is my thought. Hopefully it goes away, but ha, ah, that's so interesting. It's kind of spooky to see. It makes sense now why she keeps wearing like the long necks and stuff. Long, you know, collared things, I should say. That sounded weird. Anyways. Get to work, Mouser. We've got to take the Butterfly Miraculous back. That's all we have left anyway. <laughs> oh, sweetheart. How come the Supreme never told us that merging our Kwamis would grant us any wish we wanted? Aww. For the same reason that he never told us that using our powers would slowly destroy us. No wish will save us. Not with your miracles, no. Uh -oh. But with Ladybug and Cat Noir's, most definitely. Uh oh! It seems like we'll get along just fine. My plan is simple. We are in 
big trouble now, but oh, I love this special. There's so much drama. If you don't want us to destroy this world, then come out, come out wherever you are. Oh, you are new buddies. I guess they're not hiding after all. I must have acclimatized them. What a holder of the butterfly miraculous has done, another can undo. Oh, really? Well, that's nice. Oh. They're not akumatized villains. You think Monarch could have lent them a miraculous? If that's true, we'll never defeat them. Huh? Hey, girl. My plan is simple. <gasps> my plan is simple. That's the room where I first arrived. I was there for a sleepover at my friend Marinette's. Your friend Marinette? Is she safe? Yes, I made sure of that. And she's confirmed with me that she's okay. <laughs> Don't look at her like that. You make it so obvious. This is only the beginning of their trap, and even though Alia recorded it all, no matter how much I think about it, play it back to myself, I can't find any plan against a trap like this! Uh-oh. <laughs> Lady, I know you're having a hard time right now. Yeah. But I believe in you more than ever. You're the best at finding the craziest ideas, even when everything seems lost. It's like your lucky charms. They never make any sense, <laughs> but they work every time. Thank you, Cat Noir. Don't lose hope. I'm sure there's a solution. Oh. I... I do have an idea, but I'm afraid it might be too convoluted. We're all ears, Ladybug. Aww. Okay. Two hours later. Unify. Oh, look at it! It looks so cool! Oh my gosh, she looks amazing! Oh, it's so fun! Oh my god! Oh, it's fun getting to like actually use the Butterfly Miraculous for once. I can undo it. Oh. <gasps> Oh no. I'm sorry, Ladybug. Ah! Thank you for your help, Alia. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so saucy. I'm loving this special. Oh no! It was an illusion! <laughs> oh my god, she's amazing. <laughs> Surprise, Ladybug. Lady Fly, actually. Nice to meet you. I love surprises. <laughs> I love the purple hue over her costume. It's very pretty. All right. Oh, could it be that it's just an illusion? Oh my gosh. Come on, Monarch. You gotta be seeing through this. Kenoir! Kenoir! Are you lost without your little house pet? She's got a big old hammer. Oh, no. Ooh. That's so cool. And you shouldn't count your cats before they scratch. Oh my gosh, this special is fun. It's so creative. Oh, can we please have a gun or a hammer or, or anything, a sword? I don't have your nice little life. In the world where I'm from, there are no awesome girlfriends to inspire me every day. No amazing BFF, let alone a thug, a gentle mom, or a boyfriend who doesn't think I'm a total loser. Oh. Uh, you read my secret diary. So you know we're the same, you and I. <sighs> All I've gotten is pain and suffering from that horrible Chloe Bourgeois who made me suffer throughout my entire life until the Supreme entrusted me with the miraculous. Now, no one will hurt me anymore! Reverse morphosis. Oh, that's so sweet. We can make a wish by merging it with the cockroaches. Merging these two miraculous is too powerful. There would be a great price to pay. Yeah. Nothing is too powerful. There's no price too high to pay if it would bring my mother back. Your mother? She's gone. And my father doesn't care. He's too busy designing dresses and costumes. Busy creating things like he's already moved on. Like he has no idea how much I miss her. Oh, sweetheart. I too was very angry. I too was hurt. I too was scared. I too was bullied relentlessly by Chloe. Powers didn't change my life. I changed the way I saw myself. I'm sure that if you change the way you see yourself and your world, you'll be able to fix what's wrong with it too. Just like I do here every time. 
Aww. You can fix it all. If you knew about the wish, why haven't you tried it? I won't tell you that I never thought about it. Of course I thought about it, but everything comes at a price if my mother came back. Our mother! Hi. Okay. In order to bring our mother back, someone else would have to lose theirs. Wow. And that I can't wish on anyone. I can tell you about my friends from this world. You should meet them in yours. You'd probably get along. Take Nino, for example. Nino? I don't think he'd want to be buddies with me considering how I treated him. He's the most understanding person I know. Just apologize and invite him to the movies. His favorite <laughs> film, here anyway, is called Space Mutants vs. Ghost Shark. <laughs> You're really making me want to watch it. Oh, this is really cute, Bubbles. Miraculous Shady Bug! Peace though. I love it. Aww. Thank you. Oh, did the cataclysm go away on him though? Hey, I like your new look. Fancy bug. It wouldn't hurt you to do the same. Can I? Did go away. <gasps> Meow! And now I'll be called Furry Pop or the Wonder Whiskers or Maid of oh, Justice or uh, I just can't pick one. Oh, it's so cute. I'll call myself <gasps> Ladybug. Oh. <laughs> hey, the best there is. Aww, look at everybody getting along and bonding with one another and helping them see the good. It just shows us that our, our two main characters are just so just brave and strong and they've learned so much and they've just grown over these seasons. It's fun to really just like put it in perspective of like how things could have gone or how they could have turned out, even though all these like, you know, difficulties and obstacles came in their way. They still are like good people and they're helping others to be good people, too. I love it. It's so sweet. Uh oh, it's far from over, Lady Buck. Oh. He's not going to do anything, is he? I choose access to any other existing universe. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm feeling a disruption. How much do we have left of this special? Will he be able to travel across universes? And attack every ladybug and cat noir in existence? I'll handle it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh look at her hair! World, Mark. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> Kitty Noir! Oh, this is fun. Goofy, but fun. Not oh. Here either. oh, it's like the pilot episode. That's fun. I love the 2D drawings in this episode. Whoa. I love that design. That was beautiful. Ladybug, I will destroy you. Mr. Bug there you too, which and is also every fun. other ladybug in all the parallel universes. Getting to see all these alternate worlds is amazing. It's so fun. I love that we get uh, our uh, Scarbella and King Noir, some of my favorites, honestly. Adore those girls. And then we get more of the like 2D drawn ones, more comic book looking style. And then that last one, what was that? Cause we had um, Mr. Bug, but then what was Marinette? Was she the butterfly user there? It seemed that way, or maybe both of them combined Ladybug Butterfly. I don't know, but that was so cool to see. So interesting. I love it. Monarch won't be going to any other world other than this one anytime soon. And here, Cat Noir, me and our friends, will make sure to put an end to his reign. And you two have gained new teammates. Aww. Yeah, by the way, we're gonna need a team name. Like the Supreme Movers. You know, a blend of Supreme and Removers. Get it? Get the joke? Don't get smart, Fleabag. Yeah, kiss her. Kiss her good. When the Supreme figures out that we're no longer on his side, we won't be laughing. He won't be laughing either, believe me, because we'll be stronger now that we're together. In our world, we always do a little something when things end well. Oh, stop! <laughs> <laughs> that was adorable! And she's like holding his little hand, too. 
really going which way? If we hadn't found ourselves sitting next to each other at the start of the school year, I don't know if I would have become confident enough to become Ladybug. I only made the right choices because you're a good person, Alia. <laughs> what if we made the right choice now and got some delicious breakfast? I'm gonna be honest, I know they're just like besties, but that was a little bit intimate. <laughs> Like, they were just kind of, like, holding each other, like, very, very intimately. <laughs> like, it wasn't even just, like, the cute little, like, cheek kiss. <laughs> well, this was fun. Okay, I can already say, hands down, this was my favorite special. This was so fun. Like, okay, again, I know some of you guys are done and over with the multiverse stuff. You want it gone. It's been overdone. I get it, but I love this. This was so fun just to see the other possibilities for what these characters could have ended up like. Granted, the whole Supreme thing is like intense. Obviously, like, it's a little extreme and our world just doesn't have that. But I think it's very possible that the Guardians of the Miraculous could have done something like that. Like, if things had been different, we would have kept that power, you know, done away, kept control and order. But, oh my gosh, I just, I love the designs of a Shady Bug and Kala Noir, even at the end, after we kind of like free them and got the new designs, I love them. I just, I think it's fun having Marinette with the little red streak in her hair. I think it looks really pretty. It looks fun. It really helps kind of tie the outfit together in the end. So I love it. And then getting rid of the green hair <laughs> from Kala Noir a win, an absolute win for us all. I think it looked disgusting, but seeing it actually in the episode and him going about and with his like kind of purpley magenta eyes, it looked fine. It looked much better than like we saw in the renders at least, but I love the he's back to his blonde hair. And like, also we learned that like, he's the one that's like kind of in love with Marinette. I think it's cute that he's just like admiring her from afar. Like, oh my God, like the little emo boy has a crush. <laughs> like, oh, that's just precious. <laughs> so way, way, way too funny. <laughs> Super cute though. And getting that very tragic moment with Shady Bug where she's reading through the diary, which I think for once was a useful thing to have. Granted, they could have talked it over, what have you. But for once, Marinette's diary was actually helpful. Like, I forget that that's a thing. And I honestly think Marinette needs to burn that diary or better lock it up. Because she cannot be writing like, I had such a great time with Cat Noir. It's like, honey, please. Like, you don't be so dumb. Like, Lila is absolutely going to use that shit against her in like season six. I assure you, <laughs> like get rid of your diary. Like if your parents were more nosy, they would know your identity. Granted, they might already know your identity, but they would know your identity if they were nosy parents. <laughs> oh my gosh. But it was also lovely. And yeah, getting to see Shady Bug read it and her like start kind of crying and getting emotional because she wants it too. Like she wants that sweet, wonderful life. Oh, that was so tragic. Like I just wanted to hug her and be like, come here, little emo girl. Like it's okay. We can go listen to some like my chemical romance. I'll show you the black parade and you will have your life changed forever. <laughs> Oh, but it was so good. I, I loved it. It was such a good special. Now, I, I don't get me wrong. The other ones were fun too. But this one just had some chaoticness to it. It was fun seeing the alternate designs. Um, We love seeing Monarch fail. Yes, we love his failures. 
<laughs> but I think it was also really fun uh, due to the fact that we get to see better fly. It's so hard to say. <laughs> it's so intrusive, you know? I am a little bit sad due to the fact that we did not get more of Nino. He kind of got just pushed to the side a bit. But it is good to see that like Nino is still a part of the resistance no matter the universe. And then maybe I should lighten up on Nino a bit more since Nino's a good person. And uh, like in every universe we have seen, he's good. So maybe I shouldn't be so mean to him because he means well. He's just like, maybe not the brightest, <laughs> you know? Ugh. But it was cool to see alternate Ollie and alternate Nino. We got to see both uh, Adrian and Marinette kind of in their universe. It doesn't seem like as desolate as I would have thought. It seems like everything is so pretty the same. Because like we saw alternate Adrian kind of looking at alternate Marinette when she's in the bakery. And the bakery still seemed chill. It just maybe her parents aren't as kind or maybe her more standoffish behavior is causing her parents to also be more, you know, strict and like meaner to her is maybe my guess that maybe she shows a bit more love and care to her parents. Maybe they would also reciprocate those feelings back. I should state though, that does not always work. Some parents are just assholes. Okay. Just assholes. So just remember that you need to try first though. You need to push first and you need to be the one to be nice and kind, but you know, sometimes they're not going to reciprocate back. So just keep that in mind, kiddo. <laughs> I appreciate how much goofiness we had between Shadybug and Clan Noir. Our, our focus really stayed on them and I'm glad. I kind of was afraid that maybe we would follow more closely to like our Marinette, our Ladybug and only get um, Butterfly Hesperia which I was going to be a little bit sad about because Shady by Clan Noir show stopping. Like, I love them. I think it's cool that they're able to keep just using their powers over and over again. Uh, just generally cool. I know it's because they're bad and they were hurting themselves. I understand. But generally so cool. And I like the fact that at the end of this all, like, Gabriel once again had his, like, crackpot idea that he was like, I'll just keep going to other multiverses and try to, like, figure it out here. And it, like, didn't work every single time. So, love that. Obviously, we can't really, like, get any miraculous back or change anything because this episode was in the past. But, oh my gosh. Just think, this is, like, canon, okay? Canon. This is in the storyline this is before he melted down, like, all the miraculous. But to think that, like, he again failed. Like, we saw another failure. This man has failed so many times because he has gone back in time so many times. He, you know, we had all of this. And he has failed infinitely, even in multiple universes. He is thwarted by a ladybug. Like, damn, dude, she's just like a, what, she's 15 or something now? You live, it's like, come on, bro. <laughs> I need you to think a little bit more. I know by this point, he's gone off the rails. Like, there's no hope for him. I get it. Don't get me wrong. I do know that. But like, every time I'm just like, this show is so good at knocking him down and just being like, this dude is the worst, like the dumbest villain, <laughs> the most incompetent villain ever. <laughs> and it's fun. I love it. It's so silly. <laughs> oh my gosh. But this special was amazing. Like I said, hands down, my favorite special. Getting to see and kind of connect with these two characters who have had very different lives than the Marinette and Adrian we know was very fun. Getting to kind of learn about their lives, how, um, you know, reverse Adrian kind of mentioned that he had been very mean to Nino. And I, I don't know. I'll be honest. I would not. I would be mad if we had like another special with them. 
like getting to go back to their universe and to see how things have changed would be kind of cool. I know like basically they start just merging into like the universe we know, but it'd be interesting to learn more about the Supreme and kind of get kind of get that backstory and how like they take it down. Like even if it's not like with our Marinette, I wouldn't mind another special that just follows Shady Bug or Ladybug now and Claw Noir and kind of pushing forward with them to learn how they kind of end up saving their world and taking down the Supreme. Like if it was just a special with them, I wouldn't dislike it. Like, I think it'd be really fun and interesting. Like, a big, epic special. I like it. With the resistance and everybody, we get to see all the kind of, like, the reverse characters. It'd be kind of fun. I also just want to see Chloe. Because, like, apparently Chloe's still mean in the other world. <laughs> Which, understandable. I think everybody's just kind of meaner. But, like, I want to see Chloe. Like, why is she still mean? I thought she'd be more, like, meek and mild temper or something. But like, no, she's just still mean old Chloe. <laughs> like, okay, sure, girl, like, pop off, queen. Keep being, keep being mean, I guess. <laughs> no matter the world, Chloe is the worst. Utterly the worst. Oh, <laughs> uh, but this was fun. It's a little bit bittersweet because I know this is the last time we're going to get Keith on a show well for miraculous i should say so it's kind of bittersweet knowing this is kind of the last stuff that keith got to work on and that gabriel's just kind of gone away with and that doesn't mean that gabriel maybe didn't like record some videos or something for adrian it's entirely possible there may also be some flashbacks that he's featured in because if we stop and think with season six coming late, late, late next year, Marinette, as of this point at the end of season five, knows the secret to Gabriel and Monarch and Adrian doesn't. So we have to deal with that still, which will be interesting. Um, and then kind of deal with Lila now having the Butterfly Miraculous, which... Oh my gosh, can I just say, I'm so glad Nuru, like, finally had some, like, respite, like, a good time in another life, because, oh my gosh, Nuru just is, like, the poorest little baby ever, like, I just want to, like, hug Nuru, because, like, oh, like, went from Gabriel to then having to be used by Lila now, like, poor baby, at least in this multiverse, Nuru got to be with a Gabriel who was sweet and kind and caring and like just wants to help people and make like their dreams come true and like give them their heart's desires, you know, like more friendly. So <laughs> I think at bare minimum, even if let's say somebody didn't like this special, can we just appreciate the fact that Nuru got like a happy life somewhere that Nuru was free? Because I think that's great. <laughs> but overall, I really did enjoy watching these specials. They were fun, goofy, um, you know, some interesting topics, a lot of interesting different outfits. Um, not only did we get Shady Bug and Claude Noir, we got what Better Fly. We had, um, oh, now I'm going to end up forgetting, Ubiquity with Alia, which was cool. We had Marinette's unification with the Butterfly Miraculous, which was very pretty. That was Ladyfly, which I loved. Um, and then we got to see a lot of the alternate designs too from other places, um, getting to see um, Marinette be given the uh, power from the Butterfly as well. Uh, I want to keep saying Akuma, but it's not an Akuma. So overall, just a really fun episode. A uh, great special. Gonna have to tie this over till season six, though. So I had so much fun watching this with you all. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, keep in mind, if you want to see my entire reaction to this episode, you can do that by checking out over on my Patreon page. Link down in the description below. 
And of course, I will see you all later. Bye.